US fans are taking over Lyon ahead of Sunday's final in the Women's World Cup. Their team set to take on the Netherlands. Whoever wins, the event is already being hailed as a triumph. Stadiums have been packed for big games and 70% full on average. Soccer governing body FIFA says total TV viewer numbers are on track to surpass 1 billion. Reuters reporters in France say there is a real buzz. Simon Evans is in Lyon for the final. Delighted. The level of interest, the TV fig audience figures around the world have been incredible. The crowds have been big inside the stadium. And just, just around France, there's a level of interest and, and the amount of people who've travelled here to watch this tournament. Have, these, these things have all been unprecedented. This was the first Women's World Cup in Mexico in 1971. 90,000 packed into the Azteca Stadium for the opening game. But this was an unofficial tournament. TV coverage was minimal. Some players and organisers were even banned from the sport for taking part. 48 years later, the competition is big business. Let's go, girlies! These US players preparing for the final are fated back home. Some, like winger Megan Rapinoe, are bona fide stars. Um, it'll be a great final. A sense, too, that the event is winning over male viewers and players. Former England star David Beckham won to enjoy the spectacle. And back in the US, it's no longer just girls paying attention. I mean, like, the teams, they're really good, and, you know, like, USA beat, like, th Thailand 13-0. Now, record audiences are expected to watch Sunday's final. After beating Spain, France and England along the way, the US are hot favourites. Their team and this event look ready to come of age on the world stage.